and another one. I should join them all up and make a mega conga boat. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to another one of my coin videos. This time it's a PO Box video. It's not much here, but don't let that deceive you because I've got a whole load of stuff to show you before I start opening these. Ha ha ha! Yes, I've lured you into the banknotes again, haven't I? I've lured myself into the banknotes, I think, unfortunately. I was down at Olympic Bank and a uh, nice cashier down there. I was like, I've got a whole load of these things. So there was nobody behind me in the queue and I thought, go on then, let's see. And uh, she showed me a whole lot of uh, notes I've never seen before. Now that one's got writing on it, but I have two of them, so that's great. Um, so what I'll do is I'll turn that side and that side. Have a look at that. So I've got a five pound note from uh, the States of Jersey. Now I've never seen this before. I've never seen this note. It's quite a nice wee note, actually. There's a nice wee lighthouse in there. I can't remember what that's called. Like a Corbiere, is that what the house is called? Nice! Bonnie, I'm sure that's on one of the coins as well, is that the 20p or something? Here we go. It's a real Bonnie note. It's different. Not one I've seen before, if I'm honest. I also... Polymer £10 note. Bank of Ireland. Here we go. It's in real good condition too, for bits and pieces. I don't know why some people write things on the notes, it's really depressing, but pretty sure that's just pencil. Let me see if I can remove that. I have I have something that might be able to fix that. There we go. Also, you've seen this one before, so we'll brush through this one quickly, but it's a pretty low number. There we go. So yeah, you've seen that one before. Cracking. And uh I've not had one of these ones yet. Hold it the right way round. Well, if I was to hold it the right way round, it'd be that way. But you know what I mean. There we go. Ulster Bank. Nice. It's just sitting there in Olympic Bank, waiting for me to grab it. Take it home. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Hey, hey, hey. That's mental. Quite like the, the design along the side as well. Stead after ages, and here an old school paper Bank of Ireland 20. This is in fantastic condition. I like the condition of that one. Here we go. Now I've got myself three English banknotes. Uh, I've got these because they were all in order and they were AAs, so I was like, Yes, came out of the a bank machine like that, so I was just like, brilliant. 11, 12, 13. So I'm like, yep, I'll keep those. Costly this, isn't it? Oh, blimey. So I've got little cellophane wraps to put all the rest in. I'll do that at the end of the video. Now look at this. Look at this. All the same stamp. I'll just uh, zoom into one of them, shall I? There we go. Look at how bonny that is. That is lovely. Holly, Ivy, and a Robin. Brilliant. Now, uh, I think there's an address on the back, so I shall be careful while I do this. There we go. And uh, it might be evidence too, so bear with me. Now it's coming some cellophane wrap thing with both notes. So I'll show you one at a time. There we go. This one here is the Great War. It's quite a little serial number too, the Great War. It was prefix, and 1814. And it was 1914 to 1918, of course. It's a lovely note. I saw this last year and I thought, oh, that's lovely. The, the wee poppy emblem as well at the top. And if you go to the other side, usually it has a freesia there. It's got poppies this time. In the St. Sampson's Church. Fantastic. And this one, as you can see, it's got the freesia there and a 
look at that. So the Serpentine's Church, pretty much identical to that one. However, the poppies in this one. If we go to this side, this one commemorates on the occasion of the Diamond Jubilee of Her Majesty the Queen. And there we go. So two different jersey notes there. Definitely, definitely. As you can see, Queen Elizabeth and 60 for Diamond Jubilee. There we go. So, a couple of nice wee notes I've wanted for my collection for a while now, and they're finally getting around to getting them. Yeah! So I'll pop them safely back into this little thing here. Until I can find them their own little perspex sleeve. So, on to the next one. Oh, this one. I have a feeling this is an eBay jobby. Um, no address on the back, thankfully. Let's have a wee look at this. Might need the scissors, actually. It looks pretty well wrapped. No evidence. No evidence. That's great. <laughs> now, I think this might be a sealed bag, so I better be careful when I open this thing up, eh? Don't want to be rupturing any sealed things. Oh, look, there's a wee bit here that's exposed. Maybe I could get in that way. Oh, thwarted. Thwarted. I thought I was going to get in easily there. Ah, well. You know what this means. Time for to say hello to scissors. I'll use it very gingerly at the edge. So there we go. Finally got in. Managed to get in without damaging it either. There was a lot of sticky tape. But here we are. This is something I've been after for a while. An entire bag of Paddington at the train station. My favourite of the Paddington set. And this means I've completed this. I have one at the station. I have one at the tower. I have one at Buckingham Palace. And I have one at the cathedral. So, I'll be putting them into money bags, sealing them up and making sure they're preserved, because just in case there's any little of these bits of cotton open a little bit, I don't want any air exposure. I noticed the palace one had a little tiny hole at the side there, so I've got to be careful. I don't want them damaged in any way. I'm going to put them away in the wee box. In fact, it's going to be in this box, one of the boxes that lovely Lisa has bought for me. She's bought for me loads of these boxes. And I just put these away, categorise everything. So, I think that's a nice little thing. So, I've completed the Paddington set. Please, please this bunch. I've never, I, beforehand, I was always finding stations mixed with people acts. Or something else. Was it Taylor or Gloucester? I can't remember. I think it was pretty much people act. Or it with Paddington palaces and stations mixed together, I think. But find one that was actually all train stations. Please just punch. So that's me. Anyway, enough of that one. I'm going to start wrapping these up and put them away safely. And we'll move on to the next one. There we go. Nice one. That's me done. All four Paddingtons. Tower, Cathedral, Station and Palace. All bagged up in money bags. Sealed tight. Not too tight, but just enough. And they're labelled as well. So, they're all ready. Ready to roll. To pop into one of Lisa's many boxes that she's bought me over the last nearly, well, four and a half years now, so that we've been doing this. But I've been doing the coin videos for, well, two and a half, maybe nearly three. It'll be, it'll be three sometime in the autumn, I think. But the habit didn't start with the videos, it started way before. <laughs> and there we go, right, that's all nice and sealed. Wrap that up and pop that safely in the box and move on to the next one. And to the next one, there we go. Now, <laughs> my postman got confused to the fact that he had to write Caledonian coins and pen because <laughs> the address to this one says Penguin Daddy. So I know exactly who this is from. Um, interesting to see what's in fight. I heard she, uh, she she sent me a message. Christina, pocket poet, sent me a message saying, uh, "Keep an eye out for your mailbox." I was like, "Okay." 
very intrigued to find out what it is. Let's find out. Oh, what's this? Oh, interesting. Thank you. Right, let's find out. I like I kind of guess what this is. And now he's we. I like these. I feel bad when I have to un undo them now to get in. If I know how to do that. There we go. <laughs> a lot of care and attention to this. Thank you very much. Let's have a look at what's. If there's any evidence. Because we like boats, ships, and trains. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Dear Callie, Penguin Daddy, hope this finds you well, and I hope the no wallets are useful for you. Oh yes, they will be. They will be indeed. Thank you so much. Uh, there's a special train trading card for you. Some other bits to add to your collection. Love to Lisa and Felix. I hope he's feeling better. Oh, he's he's smashing it right now. He's awesome. He's loving it right now. Thanks so much for asking. Uh, lots of love, Pocket Penguin, Christina. Ah, oh, I like the paper as well. That's a lovely paper. That's really lovely. So, notes. And we've got loads of notes to put in these things. So, yeah, I have a whole box down there of all different notes. Not just UK ones, but these will definitely be very, very useful. Thank you so, so much. Now, interesting to see what's in here. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, uh, not to damage the sticker. Oh, stamps and another one hiding in there. Lovely. I can't wait to see what this is now. Two penguin, daddy. Here's a train for you. Love pocket penguin. <laughs> one for the book. Nice. And is that just had that bag of coins as well? That's awesome. Here we go. Paddington at the station. And I'm very sad that they never mentioned HST down here, but hey, at least I know what the train is. There we go. Fantastic. That's smashing. Thank you so much. And now I'm excited to see what stamps we've got today. An oil wagon, 1890s. These will be all other countries. A mail wagon. Hey, that's old school. That's proper old school. Hey. Oh, Centenary Railways in New Zealand. I like that. That's Bonnie. That is really Bonnie. Ah, boats. RMS Queen Elizabeth II. Oh, the QE2. That's an awesome one. I remember growing up seeing that. Never been on it, but saw it a lot on TV. There's another one, QE2. And the same. Fantastic. There we go. QE2. Another one. Should join them all up and make a mega conga boat. <laughs> there we go. That would be... I wonder how, lo how long that would be, all these QE2s together. 1895 Centenary of Snaefell Mountain Railway. I want to go up there. I want to go up to Isle of Man, up the Snaefell Mountain Railway. I want to see the big, uh, the big wheel as well that's up that way. I can never remember what it's called. It's a huge wheel. Is it a water wheel or a power wheel or something like that? I can't remember. It's massive and I want to go and see that. But look at that. Look at the detail. Caledonia on construction duty. <laughs> there you go. Happy little accident. Good scar, seven. Oh, lovely. So I'm on construction duty. There's Grenada. Beach Twin Bonanza. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> uh, upside down. What's that one? Magia poster. I used to love Magia poster stamps back in the day. My dad had a stamp album and I would like look through them all and they were all like the, the space exploration ones with probes, satellites, uh, things like the Gemini and Apollo. 
and uh, Mercury Project. Oh, look at that. That is cool as. That is brilliant. I like that. Hard to focus, but there we go. It looks like the the fire engine from Trumpton. <laughs> Hugh Pew, Barney Bikuru, Cuthbert Double Grub. And the electric railway. I love man. Brilliant. I love that. Nice. Thank you so much. And these will definitely go to good use. Um, they'll do first a lot of my notes, to be perfectly clear. Oh, that would be awesome. I think I might have a couple of notes that might not fit, but that's okay. That is okay, because I'll be, I'll, be I'll be buying an album anyway. I need to buy an album, and I'll, buy, I'll make sure to buy one that fits these, so that I can have this one and any other ones I attach in the whole same book. And then that way I can have all my notes together and go, look at this. And it'll be glorious. Thank you so, so much. That is so kind of you, Christina. And I'll, I'll, sh I'll shout out Felix and Lisa for you as well. Felix is doing better. Yeah, of course he's doing. He's a wee drama. <laughs> but he's lovely. Uh, thank you so much. Anyway, I'm going to get a recap on the go. We'll see what we've got today. And just like that, like magic, there's a recap of everything that we've got in today's video. We've got the two jersey notes, the Queen Elizabeth Diamond Jubilee and the Great War notes, the five pound jersey note, the 10 pound Bank of Ireland polymer, the 10 pound uh, Diamond Jubilee 10 pound note from Scotland, the Ulster 20 pound bank note, the Bank of Ireland 20 pound old school paper note, the three in a row from the Bank of England ATM that got an Olympic bank, uh, my Paddington at the station, completed set now, and also can't forget the lovely gifts from Christina Pocketport, my penguin buddy. Got the banknote uh, wallet, We've got the conga of the QE2, got the, the trading card with Paddington at the train station, and all the miscellaneous stamps for trains, planes, automobiles, ships, and everything else in between. Fantastic! What a wonderful day! What a happy time to be alive! So anyway, thank you so much. Um, I'm off the now to make another video. Maybe have a cup of tea in between. And uh, so if you're having a hunt, have a happy one. Don't forget, check your change, Charlie now. Check all your wallets, check all your money. You might have a bank note that you never knew you had. Anyway, I'm off the now. Catch you soon. And cheery bye.